Hey yo, what's up? It's Homer P Drums, man. I want to talk about something. I was on uh, I was looking at the you know the video on Breakfast Club about Juju, about Juju and Cameron and stuff, man. And she was you know talking about the situation with her and Cam. But you know uh, I have an opinion on, on that situation. I'm not gonna get deep into it because I don't know them. And you sometimes you you know you don't know what the fuck goes on and people be assuming stuff and all that and bust bust their gun too fast and talk about well Cam the bad person or Juju the bad person when y'all don't even know them you know what I'm saying you don't even know these people and you wasn't there when they was going through what they was going through but it's one thing that I can say from a fact from an outside looking from from the outside looking in is that and from my experience. That most people, the problem with they do, they get with people for the wrong reasons. Y'all get with people for the wrong reasons for your selfishness, man. Facts. Another thing what people do, I'm going to give you an example. Let's say I like to go to the strip clubs. Let's say you met me. I was always going to the strip clubs. Or let's say he meet a girl. And she was a stripper. Just giving y'all an example. That doesn't mean so. So you can use your mind to think of many things that you might have a disagreement about. Or let's say she liked to do swing, or say she bisexual, or let's say you know, uh, you know anything. Or he, same thing with Bob. He he sell drugs, or you know he don't take care of his kids, or you know, any type of situation, right? So now you meet this person. Two things they do is one is that people make love to ask questions last. Y'all fucking. And they be like, oh, oh, you know you had, you was married or you have this many kids or that type of crazy situation happens. How I know, I don't did the shit. You know what I'm saying? Or two, Once they once they know this person is like this, and they know what this person do, especially with women when it comes to this part, they try to change you. They like a nigga, and they try to change. Oh, I can change him. Can't change no fucking nigga. You can't change no dude, man. And no dude can't change no. Why people saying try to change with y'all, with y'all magicians or something? You can't change no grown ass and adult. You know what I'm saying? What you're supposed to do is, is like, hey, yo. We once I, once you see that this is not what it is, don't jump in no relationship. Once you, that's why when you meet somebody, you take your time out to deal with them, get to know them, friends with no insecurities. Once you see what you see, you don't jump in no relationship. And the reason why, because these, this is why these problems happens when y'all get together and y'all break up and y'all fall out because ain't nothing going right. You disagree with the things, now you're trying to change them. Stop taking pictures. Stop uh, liking people on Instagram and Facebook. All the small little dumb shit that they was already doing before they met you. Yeah, I understand you're supposed to compromise and all that, but y'all choose to pick the type you're dealing with. You know what you're going to get. If you get if you meet a rapper that's in the song saying, yo, I fuck bitches and I don't, I don't care about these hoes and uh, this and that, woo, woo, that's what you're going to get. If you meet a female that say fuck niggas and I hate dudes and I don't care about them and woo, 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 nine out of ten, that's what you're going to get. So don't feel no kind of way and be mad when them same situations happen to you. That's people stop making excuses, man. Y'all be playing yourself. Y'all be trying to change people. You can't change people, man. Okay. I'm not saying you can't. I don't know what your powers are. You might have the powers to change what you want to change. But what I'm saying is that why would you want to try to change an adult? If you're an adult, you should already know what you should do and what you shouldn't do. If you're, if you're not on the same page, you're just not on the same page. Then turn to another page. It, it just don't click. You know what I'm saying? And that's real advice, man.
So, uh, so my point is like, end of the day, you can't satisfy everybody. Everybody's not your type. Everybody think it's always about looks. Like just because you look good, that don't make your ass a good person. Everybody just go. Everybody just go off of looks. Looks this. Looks that. Looks that. Forget about everything else. Just looks. That shit don't mean nothing, man. Yeah, you want somebody that you're attracted to, but at the same time, that don't mean nothing, man. That don't make you a good person. And that don't make you a bad person. Looks don't mean shit. Oh, I'll be saying the comments. Oh, she look good. You know what I'm saying? She can get anybody or get her a good person or whatever. That shit don't mean what? Just because she look good? No. They just gonna wanna fuck. You know what I'm saying? It's about your personality, your character, your morals. Everybody different. Everybody think different. Some people evil, some people good. And when you meet each other, that's why you don't put your feelings into it. All these emotions, you know, insecurities about what they doing, who they talking to on the phone. Fuck all that shit. You can't do all that when you meet somebody. I never did that with no chick, man. When I meet a chick, I be like, yo, I don't care what they do. We can go out to eat right now. Ten niggas call her phone. I'm cool with it. But they get mad if somebody call my phone, though. I don't feel no kind of way about them situations because end of the day, she's not entitled to me. She's not mine. She's not my wife, and she's not wifey material at that moment that I know of. So it's no insecurities because I don't have the right. I don't have the right to try to tell her what she can and what she can't do. I'm not gonna go. If I got to, then we need to be together, straight up. That's what real dudes do, man. Everybody is control freaks. They want to control the situation. Want to control everything. They want to tell people what they can and can't do. The fuck y'all getting off of that, man? I, I, I like it natural. That your mind is already on that level that you already know what to do. But you know what I'm saying? Correct me if I'm wrong. There's Hummer P drums. Like I say, make your comments, but don't get on here and be disrespectful. If you get on here and be disrespectful, I know you're not man enough, you know what I'm saying, to talk about what you're talking about, a woman enough. You know what I'm saying? And I know how the social site shit get. I ain't worrying about all that, man. Peace.